Dr. Ryan, your direct examination, beginning of this hearing, you were asked for pediatric deaths because of COVID. Do you recall that? Yes. And your testimony on that first day of hearing was that there were three pediatric COVID deaths. Sorry. Your testimony on the first day of hearing was that there were three pediatric deaths in Rhode Island because of COVID. Do you recall that testimony? Objection. That's an inaccurate summary. The doctor clarified it was based upon the CDC standard for COVID deaths. They changed it. You changed it. I'm asking you the first day you testified, you used the words because of COVID, right? I don't remember. I don't remember saying because of. I thought it was. My position has always been that it was associated with or attributed to the meet the CDC definition. So the CDC's definition could include deaths not because of COVID. The CDC's definition has been the same throughout the pandemic. It's any death with a positive COVID test. We've been using the same definition the whole pandemic. Any death with a positive COVID test. Any death with a positive COVID test, yes. So a 16-year-old who gets shot in the head is rushed to the hospital, is tested positive for COVID, and then dies with a gunshot wound to the head. That's a COVID death? It meets the definition of the CDC. So I think in your state's brief, they indicate there's over 600 COVID deaths in this country so far. How many of those deaths were people who didn't die because of COVID? I don't have that information. Does it make you curious at all, doctor? You know, we're going by the CDC's definition. Of course, I'm curious. You know, from what I can base on other information I see, number of people being admitted to hospitals, number of people in ICUs, number of missed seats. It's my opinion that COVID is a major public health threat to the people of this country and this state. But it's also your testimony that that number, 600,000 deaths or more, is unverifiable because it could include thousands of deaths not caused because of COVID. So you're speculating. I believe the current number is over 700,000 people who have died that are attributed to COVID. As long as we're using the same consistent process, it's fair to do that. And I think at this point in the pandemic, it doesn't make sense to change definitions now. Now, you know, you just used another word, doctor, attributed to. Is attributed to because of? Or is attributed to you just happen to have a positive test, but you died of something else? Like I said, we're using the same definition the Center for Disease Control Prevention uses. Does the Center for Disease Control use the phrase attributed to? No, they don't. Okay, so you, when you use that in this book just now. Okay. Yes, I did. Again, I'm trying to be very precise with our language, doctor. Yes, I understand. Okay, you can die with COVID or because of COVID. That's right. Okay, and it's your testimony that a COVID death will be reported even if you die with COVID but because of something else. Yes. Okay. And in fact, the three children who died in Rhode Island did not die because of COVID deaths, right? They died with COVID. Right. In fact, your spokesman, is it Joseph Wendelkin? Is he the spokesman for the uh, Department of Health? Yes, he's a public information officer. Yeah. In fact, he, um, on numerous occasions, has had to correct the public perception out there that these three deaths were because of COVID, right? I've done the same thing myself. Right. In fact, um, Dr. Uh, Wendell, uh, I'm sorry, Mr. Wendelkin said, sent an email to a radio personality by the name of Matt Allen back in May saying, we have had three COVID-19 associated pediatric deaths in Rhode Island. In one instance, the child had a very significant underlying medical issue. The child was COVID-19 positive, but it is not believed that COVID-19 contributed to the child's passing. Would you agree with that statement? Yes. A second fatality was similar in a child who was COVID-19 positive, but it was not believed that COVID-19 played a role in that child's passing either. Do you agree with that statement? Yes. In the third instance, the cause of death was considered undetermined. Do you agree with that statement? Yes. So you wouldn't want to try to be misleading this court or the public that three children in Rhode Island died because of COVID. I don't want to mislead the court ever. So if in the transcript it says you use the words because of, that was just a grave mistake. I've already admitted if I said that, I misspoke. 